We run a pig every five years. And five years ago when we ran the pig, back at that time, the technology, we had to run two separate pigs. And one pig was a geo pig, and that would do our, give us our mapping, GOP co GPS coordinates, and also had a calipers in there would give us, let us know if there was any dents or deformation to our pipeline. And then we would have to run an MFL tool, which would give us metal thickness and also uh, give us the, uh, um, any strains or, or um, movement on the pipeline. Um, since then, technology has caught up to where they were able to run, to combine all that, and they call it a C-pig, combo pig. Well, in a gas stream, it's fairly straightforward. It's, it's, they've been able to use it pretty regularly in a gas stream. RCO2, being that it's a different characteristics, they weren't sure if that was going to work or not, and they offered, offered to us to, to try it. This type of inspection is real critical in, key, in uh, ensuring the operation of our pipelines, that we can stay ahead of any issues that may be coming up as far as corrosion. Um, if we see anything's happening, we can tackle it right away before it comes um, an issue as, say, like if we would have to lower pressure. Um, one of the remedies would be to lower the pressure until you can make a repair if there was a substantial amount of metal, metal loss. But with our pipelines, lowering the pressure would affect the product going downstream of, of being able to deliver our product. So, so we were able to conclude that the combo pig would be compatible in our CO2. And the benefit of, to us as our company was that we could run one pig, which was at a substantial savings compared to the prior runs. We had to run two separate pigs to collect the same amount of data.